For the first time since July 2021, the long-awaited Rayquaza has finally come back to raids in Pokemon Go, and I intend to get the shiny right here and right now. We are going to be raiding until we get Rayquaza in Pokemon Go. Shiny form, that is. But there's a twist to this. If I don't get it, because I have not had good luck recently with raids, so we're doing it in sets of 10. If I don't get a shiny Rayquaza in 10 raids, we have to transfer every single one that we caught, even if we get the hundo. So there's potential for some serious pain in this video. And without further ado, we are jumping straight into these raids because we might potentially be in for a long day because there are queues for these raids because today is literally the first day Rayquaza is available to raid and we will be getting that shiny. Maybe on the first First one. If I get it on the first one, I'm telling you guys now, potentially we'll flop my top. Now starting out, we will be looking for the Hundo CPs are going to be 2191 non-weather boosted and 2739 weather boosted CP. Don't ask me why I'm using a pillow swine. This is just the team that it gave me. So don't judge me for using a middle stage evolution. And Rayquaza number one goes down. This is probably the Shundo that I want the most because of course, for those who don't know, it has a mega form. So that makes it even even more useful but we got 16 balls shiny Man. 2140 non weather booster this one's gonna be kind of decent but not good but either way on to the next one and quickly jumping into raid number two for Rayquaza and I have a great explanation as to why I was using pillow swine earlier and that is because Rayquaza is double weak to ice types and that's why it auto gave me pillow swine because I think I only have one mammal swine so it's giving me the next best option Rayquaza being a dragon and flying type are weak to dragon of course all dragons are weak to dragon fairy double weak to ice and rock types you're just General best counters are going to be Galarian Darumaka, Mega Glalie, which I would not recommend using a Mega type against Rayquaza. I would recommend Megaing a Flying or a Dragon type, so that way you can maximize on Candy, Mamoswine, Glaceon, Weavile, Mewtwo with Ice Beam, and that's just a general feud. Any Ice type really is going to work really good against Rayquaza. Second one goes down. Did not get a chance to look at the CP. We're going to go to summary real quick. We get 16 balls. Shiny on number two. Come on, 2717, on to raid number three. And back with another Rayquaza raid, what else did you expect? As of right now, Rayquaza gets a brand new move known as Breaking Swipe, and that move actually makes Rayquaza the 12th best Pokemon to use in the Master League. So it is an absolute monster. But of course, to make it good in Master League, you have to fully max this thing out, and to max this thing out, you need 296 XL candies. So you're gonna have to be doing a lot of raiding, and with Pokemon Go potentially nerfing remote raiding, this could be a hard thing to do you need to catch this pokemon and rayquaza number three goes down this is gonna be the shiny third time's a charm i'm telling you right now this slump is over right here right now I hate everything. On the PvE side of things for Rayquaza, obviously. Also, before we get to the PvE side of things, uh, I did end up catching the first, second, and third Rayquaza. First and third one, terrible. Second one was actually a 14, 14, 14 IVs. So that one's actually good, and I really hope I get to keep it because I don't have a good Rayquaza. But for the PvE side of things for Rayquaza, Rayquaza is actually a very extremely meta-relevant Pokemon, especially with it getting a Mega at some point in the future. It's going to be probably the best, if not the very best, dragon type whenever it does get its mega form who knows when that's going to be knowing niantic it's probably not going to be for a very long time 17 balls shiny no 2684 not going to be good on to raid number five so for those who haven't seen it i'm going to throw up a picture right here of shiny mega rayquaza which is going to be probably the most if not the second best mega type in the entire game right behind mega mewtwo because that should be probably the strongest pokemon in pokemon go could be wrong don't quote me on that on raid six it's not. 2137. Not gonna be any good. On to the next one. So I'm pretty sure last raid I said that was raid number six. This one is actually raid number six. And just an update for you guys, I have caught every single one so far, but yet no shiny. And if we don't catch it in the next five raids, all of those, including the 14, 14, 14, all get transferred. Raid number six goes down. 17 balls, shiny. I'm gonna cry again. I believe raid hour has officially ended and we were only on raid number seven. So the queues to get into Rayquaza are getting extensively long, longer than they have been at least. This entire video so far, I've been able to get into these raids back to back to back to back. Also, if you guys are wondering what I am using to get into raids, I use an app called Poke Genie. You can download it on your iPhone or your Samsung. I'm not spoofing. I guarantee you guys that now I do not spoof. What I did mention earlier about Niantic potentially nerfing remote raid passes and 
account and limiting them. Apparently it is rumored that you are only going to be able to do six remote raids in a day. So that might put a hindrance on videos like this. So if you guys do enjoy videos like this, let me know if you guys would want me to continue them with the limited uh, remote raid passes, because obviously if they do limit it, I'm going to have to go out and do a lot more exploring to try and get raids. Raid number seven goes down. I'm really hoping this is the shiny. These queues are getting way too long. 15 balls, shiny. Give it to me. I didn't push the button. Give it to me. Come on, man. 2137. This one's gonna suck. For those of you who have watched my the last few of my videos, I've been talking about how I am on a cold streak of shiny legends. Man, I didn't get the Tapu Coco. I didn't get Reggie Rock. I didn't get Reggie Steel. It has just been absolutely miserable to get the shiny legends. I didn't get Tapu Lele. Granted, I didn't try to get shiny Tapu Lele, but man, it has been rough for me. And now Rayquaza's being rough for me. Honestly, I just need Yveltal to come back because Yveltal, me and him are besties. I got back-to-back -back shinies, back-to-back -back shinies on the very first one. This one, not gonna be shiny. 2159, not gonna be the hundo. It's gonna be subpar at best. To raid number nine. So on to raid nine we go and update for you guys. I potentially might have a fix for the wind issue that I've had with a lot of my videos. Over Christmas, I did get a mi an actual microphone for my camera and the microphone did come with a cover this this was actually it right here just a little little foam cover for it to help protect with like wind and stuff like that i've recently done some research and found this is not the best way to help with wind there is actually a different thing i believe it's called a dead cat and this is what it looks like it's the little puffy thing it looks like a fur ball literally it looks like a fur ball so the next vlog you guys see from me it's actually going to be hoen fest so keep an eye out for that rayquaza number nine gonna be shiny I'm gonna cry again. And we're on to the 10th and final raid of this batch of 10. And, and if you guys forgot from the beginning, this one isn't a shiny. We transfer all of them that I caught and I caught them all. So we will be transferring potentially 10 Rayquazas if this one is not a shiny. This cold streak is for real. And I don't even think it's just with legendaries. It's been a while since I've gotten a full odds shiny Pokemon. But that's all gonna stop here because Rayquaza number 10 is gonna be good to me. 15 balls. We're only gonna need one shiny. <laughs> and as I said, I'm a man of my word. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten Rayquazas. Man of my word, we didn't get in the first batch of ten. Include. Goodbye. Non shinies. Man, and I got a 14, 14, 14, man. <sighs> We go again. And we're on raid 11, and I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. If this Rayquaza is shiny, I'm gonna be pissed. Genuinely upset, especially if it's a bad one. Like if it's a 10, 11, 12, or something along those lines. If it's a two star and it's a shiny, I'm gonna lose my mind. 21, 27, it's not gonna be good. I know it's bad, but it's gonna be the shiny. Just watch. Okay, never mind. I'm a liar. Next. All right, and there goes raid number 12. No idea what the CP was. 12 balls, because I did nothing. Shiny. Bro, what is going on with my luck recently? We go next. Raid number 13. 10,000 XP. 14 balls. Not going to be the shiny. I just know. It's not. See, I told you guys, 2709. This one's actually pretty good too. What a love for this one to be the shiny. Next, Rayquaza number 13 goes down. I really hope this is a shiny because I was really anticipating this being a short recording as soon as I get this shiny right here. This game hates me. And Rayquaza, whatever number this is, I kinda forgotten. I think it's 14. I forgot what I had said earlier. It goes down. I enjoy these videos, but man, this is just pain at this point. This is just torture. Shiny. Come on, man. 21, 22. Why? Ugh. And it's date number two. And of course, 
right back to where we left off i think we ended off yesterday at 14 raids i don't entirely know uh just a disclaimer today is now friday as i'm recording day two i didn't get a chance to actually raid it yesterday the second day of rayquaza i didn't get a chance to record and raid let me say that now because i did do a raid yesterday and i did do a raid today off camera those ones are not included in the 10 because they were off camera i didn't get a shiny or the hundo i did get a semi-decent one but i didn't get a hundo or the shiny and granted, if I did get the shiny while off camera, it would not have counted toward this video. We are right back to it with more Rayquaza, you guys already know. I think Pokemon Go does not want me to succeed right now. Either way, 15 balls, shiny, and a recording. I hate my life. Next raid. All right, so I just counted, and this is actually raid number 17 that we were on right now. I'll find that out after the next raid, just to be 100% sure. Either way, I know I'm not transferring anything yet, and I already know this one's going to be the shiny, so it doesn't matter which one this is, because I'm not transferring any of these requests that I just got. And that's because this one's only going to take one ball. It's a shiny. What is wrong with this game, dude? My game's broken, I think. This just does not add up. On to the next one. And of course, we're continuing on with more Rayquaza because there's nothing else we can do. I still yet to get the shiny because this video's still going on for y'all. But have no fear, guys, because the video will be coming to an end very soon. I have a feeling this one's gonna be the shiny. If it's not the shiny, don't quote me on it. Because like I said, this one's gonna be the shiny right here. Next raid. So I actually did count and remember now. This is raid number 19. So we only have this one and one more of this set of 10 to potentially get the shiny or we transfer everything again. And this one's gonna suck. Quote me on it. Watch it be the shiny too. 13 balls, shiny. We go to the next. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to raid number 20, the all important raid. If you don't know why it's important, you have not been paying attention the whole video. And the reason it's important is because if this one is not shiny, then that means we have to transfer the last 10 that we just caught. And I really do not want to transfer more shinies, but Rayquaza number 20 goes down. 17 balls, shiny. Oh my God, it's over. There's no way. They live. Oh man. Oh. There is no way I just did that. There is literally no way I just I just did that. The very last raid before having to transfer Pokemon, we finally get the shiny. Make sure we had to silver pin apps that. 2155 CP, not gonna be too insanely good, but it's a shiny nonetheless. Ladies and gentlemen, our very first shiny Rayquaza in the Pokedex. 131313. 13, 13. Honestly, I cannot be upset about that at all. Oh, I'm so happy I don't have to transfer anymore. Anyways, guys, if you if you did enjoy the video be sure to like comment subscribe all those good things i really appreciate y'all if you made it this far in the video and keep an eye out for my hoenn tour videos because hoenn tour starts tomorrow morning super excited for that keep an eye out for those videos again good luck over the weekend if you are playing over the global event i appreciate y'all i'll catch you guys in the next one peace